Hi everyone and welcome back to a new video. In today's video, I'm going to teach you that how you can use a Google Wallet. So without wasting any time, let's start our video. Make sure to watch the video till the end. First thing you need to do is to download uh, the wallet application from your Play Store. Once you downloaded the application, just open the application. Uh, the next thing you need to do is to make sure that you're signed in with your Google account. So if you tap on here, as you can see, I'm signed in with my Google account. Uh, if you want to change an account, uh, you can just uh, tap on the drop arrow icon and you will find the other accounts that which you logged in to your device, the Google account that you use. So you can choose from that one. If you want to add another account, you can do that from there as well. So the next thing you need to do is to add a payment method. So you can find the payment method here. or you can go back and just tap on the plus sign aid to wallet. So from here, you can get more options. You can add a payment card. You can add a transport pass, loyalty card, or gift card as well. And you can convert a photo to a barcode or QR code, which you can scan from your phone to pay anywhere. So the first thing we will need to learn is to add a payment card. So what you need to do is to tap on the payment card from here you can enter the card number manually. So let's suppose I will enter the card number here. So guys, once you enter your uh, the, the card number, the next thing you need to do is to enter the month and year, the expiry date on your card. The next thing is the CVC, which you will find on the backside of your card. You need to enter that one. And then you have to enter the billing address if you tap here. So you need to, uh, the first thing is the name. The next thing is that you need to choose the country where you're living and you can change it from here as well. You will find the list. You can find the country that you're residing in. The next thing is the street address, flat, city and postcode and then telephone number. So guys, once you enter all these details, the next thing you need to do is to tap on save and then they will send you um, a one-time password on your uh, cell phone from your bank to add your credit card or debit card to your Google wallet. So you need to enter that one-time passcode and then it will be done. Your card will be added and once you uh, go back and here your card will be shown and you can use it as a payment method in your Google wallet. So guys, this one was for how to add um, a payment method or a card the next thing you can do is to add a transport pass as well so if you tap here these are the different kind of options so uh, if suppose just for example i tap on this one it will bring me here so from here you can select a standard you can select a monthly plan and then you need to just select and from here you can buy a monthly um subscription from here and once you're signing in to buy this one you need to be signing in to buy and when uh, everything is done you need to just tap here and it will be added to your google wallet so from there you can use it as a transport pass you don't need to carry the passes it will everything will be here in the google wallet then you can add a loyalty card as well suppose there is a 7-eleven in thailand I need to enter it manually. So here you can enter a membership ID and then add to the wallet. And then you can scan it by paying from a Google Wallet on 7-Eleven. So this is how you can do it. The next thing is a gift card you can also enter into your Google Wallet. Just tap on this one and here, let's suppose 7-Eleven gift card, card number, pin, balance and your notes and that's it and it will be added so this is it this is how you can use uh, the google wallet you can add payment cards here and once everything is done you can use google wallet as your digital wallet as well so guys i hope this help if you find this video helpful please like the video and subscribe to my channel i will see you again in the next video till then take care